Hi there, and welcome to episode 28 of the Artifact Sect. I'm Icon, and today we're going to get further down the road of cultivation. We have unlocked a ton of new laws in the last episode. I'm extremely happy to see how far we got there. And my goal today is to uh, pimp up my body cultivator even more, of course, as it is always. And let's see what kind of uh, things we will whip up today. Shodong's initiation to the Golden Core status still has to wait until winter is upon us. Oops. Because with no winter, no, no good uh, breakthrough for him. And yeah, we're, we're a little bit stagnating in a way, but that's only on the uh, surface. That's truly only on the surface. Nyanyun and Junju are now at Primordial Spirit level, so we are also capable of refining things on a completely new level. And the next thing that I want to go for today, as quick as possible actually, will be to increase Nyanyun's chi capacity, because I feel like there's a lot more than we are right now using. Of course, this also comes with heavy investments of inspiration, but let's see what we can do. Seven slaughtering form, hell no. Max G 4,000 percent. That's exactly the kind of stuff that I wanted to have. 2,000 percent. Yeah, why not? 1,000 percent, but that's uh, counteractive. I want to avoid the counteractive skills a little bit right now. 15,000 and connective. That's, that's more like it, you know. All right, let's just study these for now and see how much uh, increase that'll make. Because honestly, there's... Uh, those were pretty uh, high numbers that we uh, tossed around there, so... Yeah, 180 grand. Honestly, I think that's uh, all we need for now. So, dear Nyanyun, now, what you need next is... Um, what's it called again? I ah, yeah, here, Spiritual Breath. Chant. Wait a sec. It's good only for breath. Here we go. Spiritual somehow didn't uh, trigger it, and you also need the Spectre Refinement. And here we go. So that should be the trick doing the trick. Okay, I just realized that there was another thing that all my cultivators way back when were using. I totally derped it out on this entire run, and a couple of people were probably asking themselves already, why the hell ain't I using meditation? I can't tell you. Somehow the Elysium mod has totally uh, fried my brain and made me forget about that wonderful technique. But considering that June is now already sitting on a permanent on a permanent good, uh, permanently good mental state, why shouldn't I use meditation, you know? Because meditation just does burn through your lifetime, but it also increases your speed of cultivation by a ton. So, let's get still. Okay, now, the dog wants to eat Prism Lotus. I say no. You can't eat Prism Lotus. I forbid that. Okay. Now, let's see. Them Tempered Kidneys. I wonder how far I should take that. I mean, at the end of the day, it does sound like something that I just want to have. Because more stamina acquisition, true chi recovery rate. But okay. Secret body true chi consumption rate increase. I wonder what, what that actually would mean, but let's see. 
we're at a let's see 14.2 we, we're just going to check out how that changes when we're learning one skill that's one of the best ways of uh, checking out the impact so 14.2 there and now it's still 14.2 So, well, according to the text, the uh, increase would only occur when the, when it's connected to a secret body anyways. I'm not too surprised that it didn't do anything. Just keep asking myself if I'm overlooking some, some problem there. But no, it's just the true chi recovery rising and rising. Or a thing. I'll take that. Why shouldn't I? Okay, so June is now cultivating in a way faster manner. Good stuff. And Nyan Yun was a fire elemental, so this is the room she's going to take. And now we're finally, finally at the spot where I can just send somebody and do a six tuple refining of that uh piece of talisman paper and all's good for his sake that was really annoying okay yay innate restoration tier four already nice okay let's go for let's leave it there don't want to overdo it you know I'll rather remold the liver a little bit. Because that hadn't had any uh, downsides either, didn't it? We just gain more essence from devouring and we increase the remolding rate. I wonder if an increase of remolding rate is actually something good or something bad. But. As far as I've understood things, it sounds a lot like it's about increasing the speed of your remolds. Again, correct me if I'm wrong here. Okay, now, let's prepare some glorious talisman paper this time. Yay! So that's that's what I like to see, you know? We're, we're just getting the job done in one go. Now begins the time where I can easily destroy all my Angus soul gems accidentally because I wasn't paying attention to the consumption of them because of the insane amount of chi. Oh, okay, it ain't that insane. Because of the uh, okay amount of chi I got right now. <laughs> Alright, dire potential slightly reduces the duration of the weakened state. I don't know. I didn't plan on weakening myself whatsoever, so... So the Five Elements Fists does want a liver upgrade, and that's the Wood Blessing, so if I come across that, I'll take it. Okay, Tempered Liver, though, does increase the Chi... Uh, in the Chi consumption of this uh, consumption of this skill so probably I should be careful about that e oh yeah can't say no to that and since we need a wood skill on the liver and I see that elm organ okay give me a sec let's add wood essence innate wood essence is innate wood essence something else? Makes me wonder. I mean, it would make sense, wouldn't it? Anywho, let's, uh... Hey, the Exultant Sect does like me a wee bit more. Awesome. Now, let's check out June's uh, progression here. Yeah, you see, that that's they didn't make any progression. They need to meditate to progress, man. How could I forget this? <sighs> Let's not think about that any further. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes it's amazing how you can neglect knowledge that you already have. 
That's always the most in uh, interesting part. Though, hell no, I'm not going to say no to an innate restoration roll. It's way too rare. The wood blessing comes by quite often. All right, let's stop the remolding here. I got no clue if this is actually worth the pain or not. But the wood blessing will increase the defense success. All right. And the attack accuracy. So fire blessing on the heart, earth blessing on the spleen, metal blessing on the lungs, water blessing on the kidneys. And that's all with increasing levels there. And the last one, ardent organ. So, well, innate, there's innate elemental essences, all right? never seen them <laughs> i've literally never seen them ever before so dark turtle shell sounds like another defensive skill to me but let's stick with the other upgrades here first so brain has had a organ remolding cap i don't think that this is something that i want to have what was the spine again the spine had a good one Bone remolding cap. So, where's the muscle remolding cap then? Because this is organ remolding on the brain. This is on the spine. But where is the organ remolding cap? Uh, the muscle remolding cap located at? Well, we're going to try out one mouth remold, one neck remold. One for each ear. I just like to go for one level of most of these. Maybe the the head, maybe the head muscles are what I need. I love experimenting. That's for sure. So tempered ears, global dodge, accuracy, defense success rate. Okay. And yet again, ears come with no downsides. Ear upgrades come with no downsides. So body cultivators have a couple of organ upgrades or uh, general upgrades that come without downsides. That's amazing. And here we have that one. I had no clue that you can do this here. Yeah. Got tons of food now. Jean can do go for other adventures, and I'm so endlessly grateful for that uh, hint. It's that. Uh, enables me now to do completely different uh, completely different what's it called again agency gameplay all right let's send jun for the breakthrough this also means that junju is eligible to rebirth now hey i'm so happy we made such huge such huge pieces of progress in the last couple of episodes you know, we, we've had a very slow roll for such a long time, and I feel like the last three episodes, we've had insane, insane progression leaps. So I want to use now Junju's last couple of uh, centuries of lifetime for more derivative calculations, because at the end of the day, I'm still missing a law, at least one. And therefore, well, you know, might as well check out what we get there so the mouth oh yeah we get a innate restoration in there too so i'm pretty sure the mouth is all about devouring stuff but again here no downsides only increase of consumption rates of secret bodies connected to the mouth but of course we take the innate restoration one there too and here we already have ears Let's go for the other ones. Tempered neck. Well, lucky me. So there goes another one without downsides. And of course, we'll take the ancestral throwback. back. I mean, if I get it uh, for free like that, who am I to say no? Okay, so secret body upgrades. And sadly, yeah, tempered flesh these muscles doesn't do anything 
too bad. Yeah, so organs are a way to go. It's all about the organs, boys. And sadly, we don't seem to have any other organs in the rest of in the, the on the other body parts. So, well, probably the bones, though, because you see, the spine does have a special interaction. So let's try out one thing. I haven't tried out the. Well, these are the finger bones. Let's try out the remaining bones that I haven't upgraded yet. I mean, you know, at the end, maybe, maybe I'm just overlooking something because I wasn't uh, thoroughly enough, but I, I highly doubt it. Just do this for the sake of completion, you know. Hey, there we go. So June is now my tier one golden core. Grand Chariot user. We're going to pump up his fighting skill now in the next uh, couple of episodes, I'd say. Let's see what Junju is uh, uncovering over there. And let's uh, check out those remolds. Thumb remold. Lifespan and appetite. Just what I expected, you know. The middle finger. Okay. So all the fingers have all... Uh, the finger bones have all the exactly same impact. Just as I had assumed. Alright. Would have been too easy, I guess. So. It's also only applying to connected uh, secret bodies. All right, but that means we also went through most of the basics. Uh, uh, let's say so. Why is there a Morrow pill lying around there? Oh yeah, because we slew some demon beasts there. Now I remember. Okay. I don't know if I really need these uh, steel bones, but yeah, just like I thought. So the spine, the spine seemed to be the only uh, bone that had a particularly special impact on on the development of this character. Everything else seems to be just uh, you know, same old, same old. Yao guy are attacking me. Thanks, guys. I was just in need for some more Angish Soul Gems. Express Delivery. Alright, here we go. And now... Let's send the Body Cultivator in. Hop, hop, smack! So devastating, and those are just the rookie numbers, you know? The, uh, this dude is far away from being closely done with anything a body cultivator could achieve. His accuracies are crap. He literally only has one skill developed now on a decent level. And yeah, there's just, uh, there's just so much more what we can still do and should still do, so... Alright, so I've heard really good things about upgrading the spine, so let's do this, even if it does increase the appetite. I mean, we do, do have enough food in, in our stockpiles here, you know. It's not like we're broke in any way. Okay. I'll let June do his thing, because he's not literally not spending any of the uh, sect's resources. Jean could be also reborn quite soonish, you know. It was all an accident, and stat-wise, he's not a not a uh, 
weak or wrong character at all. It just messed up horribly when I tried to golden core him. Didn't even try to golden core him. That was the tragedy behind that. I only wanted to do something to just to progress him before the level of that. Uh, did I just cancel? I think so. Dang. Okay. Okay, there's a charity event and City of Abundance. Let's do this. We're gaining so much money, uh, so many followers here. I mean, I wanted to say experience. It's crazy. Okay. Psychic bone, only working in secret bodies. Too bad. Harrowing bone, also only applic applicable to uh, secret bodies. Too bad. Now, uh, Junju, feel free to burn away your lifetime, please. Evil sect. And another four grand at City of Abundance. Just sacked. Manifesting Caves. Manifesting Caves. A mandate at Mount Lucian. Wonderful. So. The last law is always the most annoying one together, in my opinion, at least. It's, uh, always one that takes you forever to get there. So Mount Lucian, where was that place actually? I, I can't vaguely remember if that was in the vicinity. Ah, here. It's just one of the neighboring sects. I, and I couldn't remember them anymore. It's also a way of uh, speaking out loud what you're, uh, what you're thinking about your neighbors accidentally. Okay, here we go. So, I want to know what this uh, bone remolding cap is uh, supposed to mean. So we're going to hammer out a couple of upgrades here in that thing. I mean, overall, it does increase not too many things I am interested in. But I do want to know what that does mean. So we can only uh, learn by, by maxing it out loud. So what kind of uh, techniques do we have here, actually? Probably for God, its directions. Okay. Oh, this sounds like a delightful technique. I should try that. Because the AccuPoint remold does only do one one remold at a time. Yeah, we're, we're going to try that actually. So let's stop remolding. And I want to try out the other technique here. Because I'm absolutely interested in that. So as soon as Junju is back home, we're going to... Uh, we're going to go for more calculations here. And now I want that 8 AccuPoint. Ah, okay. This costs a lot of uh, extra stamina too. It does make sense after all. Now let's see. Ancient book. Nothing. Mandate. Add Exalted Dot. At least I consider myself pretty lucky that we trigger so many mandate spawns here. I've had that way worse in the past, where it didn't go that uh, generously, to, to put it into fr uh, friendly words here. Okay, so that does take a lot longer. It takes a lot more stamina. But, I mean, that was to be expected. Wow, this dude is regenerating stamina by now. 
Okay. Seems like these upgrades did do something for him. There's a Fey messing up or weather. This is good if you want to have that kind of weather, and it's bad if you don't. But there's always one thing. Butchering a Fey is always pretty uh, valuable. Primordial Alchemy Law. That's what we're, what we're coming for. Okay. So all cultivators head over to Exultant Isle now. Also Yuzhong. That's it. I, I really hope that we're going to get the... Uh, we're going to get that. So Fabe Hide 91. And... 11 units of Beast Blood. That's a lot. So why did it say keep remolding? I didn't mean to. Alright, let's check it out. So we can take that 8 times. Demonic Pattern. It's a new one. Okay, Ancestral Throwback. Only applicable to secret bodies. Dang. Receding Bone. It's also only applicable to secret bodies. Okay, but I did like what that did for me. Okay, we obviously do this one more time. Or why not? Why not, why not? And Zhong, you are also among people that are going for the last law. Winter is coming. Can't wait. It's going to be the breakthrough for my for my artifact crafter finally. Man, I can't tell you how, how long I've been waiting for that. Yao Gai! It's always Yao Gai attacks lately. But on the other hand, these dudes are so friggin' harmless. Okay. Nyan Yun was not eligible for this law. Okay, Yushi. Take him down! So it turns out we are now famous. We're going to stay with the sect suffix. But yeah, we... We are now a recognized sect. We can now have 36 disciples. And the power of the attacks will be increasing from here on. But honestly, it shouldn't be that much of an issue. Alright. Somebody please have the stats to accept that. Just That would be so awesome. But it doesn't look good. There's only Shodong now left. Shodong for the showdown. Stop myself. It's just happening to me. I'm sorry, guys. So, plus 3% charisma. Hmm. Actually quite neat. I mean, it ain't really uh, dramatically useful, but it's also not, un not completely useless. Alright, man. You got the power. You are also not... Okay, so let's see. We got the Blessed Pill. I think it was the Blessed Pill with the power of doing this look stuff there. So, let's see. Don't tell me that I ain't got none of these anymore. I got none of these anymore. Dang. Okay. So the only people selling that are the Mount Doom people, and they don't like me enough. So let's see. Pit of Doom. Do I have any chance of do something, doing something for you? A life pill. Sure thing, guys. Uh, you. You can have that. Are we now friends? Would be so awesome, but I don't think we are. Nope. 
They're just noping us out. Oh, man. <sighs> well, well. I don't see too much that I can do except for one thing. So, let's see. Nyanyun still has a couple of skill points here left. As far as I can remember, I've learned some skills that were increasing luck. A couple of skills just popped up lately. So here, 5%, 20%, that's decreasing, 10%, 10%, here we go. Let's see, probably that's going to be what I'll, what I can use instead. Falling treasure has happened. Porkboy's fog bow tower. Okay. Doesn't sound too treasury to me, but little do I know. Okay, she's now at a whopping 7.25 luck. That's as much as it can get for me. All right. Grab that law, my dear. Be the hero our sect needs. Thank you. Living beings. I, uh, I know. I still don't know what living beings are actually needed for, but I don't want to give them away. My panda died. Oh no. Is this one dying too? Doesn't look like so we're we're just going to set up another pasture in there for different animals you know let's see how about the bulls being in here too all right yushi is on his uh, way for that uh, last one and uh, well, at least I got somebody who has now a decent chance of trying it, I assume. Because 7.2 luck ain't that bad. Seriously. It's, uh, it's as good as it gets for us. For now. Okay, so I gained also 8 levels on that. I wanted to know, you know. So, here we go. These skills are all not looking too tasty. Okay. Yep. And there it goes. We have now seven slots on, <laughs> on bones. Okay, that that's Alright, remolding cap. That's what it's it does what it says. Wonderful. So the brain will increase the organ remolding cap then. And will also increase pain endurance. Okay. What did we have with the eyes? Alright. So these will be tweaks I'm going to take later down the road. I already made up my mind that the idea that I'm going to follow now will be quite simple. I'll be maxing out the, uh, the secret bodies that I want to use for now, and then, as soon as... I am unhappy with my percentile accuracies and such. I'm going to swap over and max out these other organs and see where I'll end with that. Okay, guys, that's uh, the end of another really, really cool episode. I've had so much fun. The only thing I'm unhappy about is that we didn't get the uh, alchemy law in our hands, but, well, one thing at a time, you know, one thing at a time. See you guys next time there. Drop your comments down below. Leave a thumbs up on that series. And of course, if you haven't done so already, check out the channel. Daily videos coming up there. You just need to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay informed with all the stuff that is daily published there. Have a good time, my friends. Bye-bye.